Welcome to Bubbles and Booey. <laughs> Today we will be returning to the Mermaid Food Cookbook for Shark Fin Pudding. First thing you do is you need to put half a cup of sugar in a pot and three tablespoons of cornstarch. It's okay to be a little messy. A pinch of salt, which we have much of. Whisk to combine. It's very smoky. It reminds me of Ursula's cauldron. <laughs> Can you do like an internship with her or something? Yeah, she's my buddy. <laughs> Shame what happened to her though. Yeah. We need two egg yolks. We got these eggs from see chickens. No! Go away! No! Don't come on! Don't come on! You know bubbles? Let me try. Okay. That wasn't a disaster at all! Yay! Then add a half a cup of heavy whipping cream. A cup and a half of coconut cream. We got that from our pirate friend, Kat, right? Yeah. She was on the beach. Then you gotta whisk it together. I let Bowie do it. Yes. Well, you know, I did have training with a lot of cauldrons. Now you're gonna set your oven to medium heat for stove top. Stove top. Human things are so interesting. <laughs> and whisk it for five to 10 minutes. Look bubbles, it's starting to bubble and thicken. Oh, it's me. Pour the mixture and sift it. Good job. Add vanilla extract. And we don't have coconut extract, so we're gonna make do and just do two apples. Then add two tablespoons of butter. Then you need to whisk it. Again. Again. Once you have mixed it, go ahead and put it in the fridge. It's warm. For three hours. That's a long time. Well, you have to let it sit. You can watch like The Little Mermaid animated <laughs> twice. That is true. And now it's time to melt chocolate. Because we will not harm sharks in the making of shark pudding. Time to melt it. <laughs> Now it's time to make your melted chocolate look like shark fins, if you can. We'll see. Good enough. Why don't you give it a try, Bubbles? Let's try. Would you like a spoon? Thank you. I may not have melted it enough. I don't know. I didn't, the recipe actually calls for melts. I just got chocolate chips, so. They're not the perfect melting ones. Oh, that looks pretty good. Yeah, that looks like a fin. And put it in the freezer. Once your pudding is settled, divide it into three bowls. You're supposed to use blue food coloring on this, but supplies are very sparse under the water. So we have green. Light, medium, dark. Light, medium, dark. So maybe one drop in there, three drops, and Ooh. five. And we'll see how it does. Yeah. And then you have to make some whipped cream when you're done with your colors. Ugh. 
smoke is weird. I don't know how you humans do it. <laughs> but luckily I have this nifty little human contraption to do it for me. Outside! Now we're going to assemble. Dark color first. It's gonna look like a lagoon. Yeah. Then your medium color. I don't know if it's actually going to set the way it does with the photo. My color just seems to be dipping right into it. So this is absorbing. Yeah. Then you're supposed to put your light. I'm not sure why that's happening. Oh, it's just sinking. Yeah, it's just sinking in versus making the pretty little layer she has in the photo. That's disappointing. Then once you're done with that, you put on your whipped cream. Hopefully that doesn't sink too. No sunken ships for us. Nope. Then for the finishing touch, Bubbles, would you like to put in our shark fin? Sure. Ta-da! Ta Time to taste test. You go first? Sure. Oop, we get a little bit of it all. Oop. I spilled. It's very sweet. And not in a good way. <laughs> oh no, our shark is not doing well. Kind of tastes like nothing. Yeah, it's it's very sweet. I don't know if the coconut extract would have made a difference or not. Kind of just tastes like sugar. And we definitely didn't get the levels like she does in the photo. It's so sad. The <laughs> king. That's what it was supposed to look like. <laughs> Did I do something wrong? I don't know if we did something wrong. Maybe our pudding isn't set like set enough, but I, I'm not sure. I mean, I could eat it, but I give it a three out of 10. What do you give it? Um, it's like, it's like a four, four or five, it's fine. It just kind of doesn't taste like anything. Like this whipped cream though. <laughs> Thank you so much for floating by. It was great seeing you. Be sure to follow us on Instagram at Bubbles and Bowie so you can see our Mermaid Melody shows coming up in New York City. All right. Happy Mermaid.